years of freedom at the inauguration of another South African president, Africa Day. Well, tonight between 7 and 8 o'clock or thereabouts, we'll bring you the 10th Thabo Mbeki Africa Day lecture live. That's to be delivered by the former Prime Minister of Ethiopia, Hala Mariam Adezalen Boshe. Boshe served as Prime Minister from 2012 until last year. To discuss, we're joined by the SABC reporter Malema Matoa, who's at uh, the UNISA Pretoria campus. That's where the lecture will be held live this evening. Malema, uh, are the guests in place? Who's there? Good evening, uh, Francis. So we come into live from uh, the University of South Africa. Yes, uh, guests uh, have arrived, and as well as uh, uh, other uh, invited uh, uh, people here. Uh, as you know, that this lecture is held annually, where uh, eminent and uh, distinguished uh, scholars and uh, thought leaders are invited to share their perspectives uh, on a variety of uh, issues pertaining to the African continent. And uh, tonight. Uh, I'm standing uh, here with uh, Dr. Soma Dodafikeni to just, uh, uh, you know, uh, tell us more about uh, the lecture. Uh, Dr. Fikeni, if you can just uh, tell us as to what this year's lecture is uh, focusing on. The main focus of this year's lecture by the former Prime Minister of Ethiopia is on the national question, peace, conflict and nation building which is a very pertinent issue in today's Africa because the intrastate conflicts have become some of the most important factors to consider as they stand on the way of development. And the theme this year, national peace, uh, uh, I mean national question, peace and security, what does that mean? It simply means that the question of building nationhood is very much connected to the question of peace and security of any state. And this has become one of the key factors that Africa to realize its agenda 2063, to realize its development goals, will have to address that question. And it is coming at the time when the former Prime Minister himself is a practitioner who has dealt with these issues in his own country and in the continent, especially in Ethiopia, where the national question and the diversity of ethnic groups trying to achieve peace has become a key issue, including the language issues. Thank you, uh, Prof. Uh, Francis, uh, we just have to release uh, uh, Dr. Soma Dodafikeni as the program is ju just about to start now and it's uh, back to you in the studio. Malema, tell us a little bit more before you go. Uh, so, so very distinguished that we have a former head of state. What's the former head of Ethiopia expected uh, to say around this theme of uh, national identity and democracy? Well, um, the issues that, uh, you know, probably the, 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 the former uh, head of state will be uh, talking about, you know, are based on uh, the issues of uh, security, the issues of uh, peace in Africa, um, and as well as, uh, you know, what it means uh, today uh, to be a pan-African in the 21st century. Very much. And remember, we're bringing you that uh, lecture live uh, between 7 and 8, and that's uh, expected to take place at UNISA.